Oh, <laughs> sorry guys. I was just uh, sipping on some Nelson Mandela pack. For some reason, people hate seeing young African men make money. Drikas Dupasi, top middleweight UFC contender, and Cameron Simon, undefeated bantamweight prospect, catch a lot of hate for the place of their birth and the way they look. Africano, Africano, African with the freak. Africano, Africano. If you don't know the backstory, Drikas, and to a lesser extent Cameron, have been facing some backlash over their statements about being African. Drikas said this. Those belts ever go to Africa? As far as I know, it came to America and New Zealand. I'm the African fighter in the UFC. Myself and Cameron. And then Usman said this. Just because you are you went over to South, South Africa and you are raised there, that doesn't make you African. And then Izzy said this. I don't want to give this clout. I will gladly drag his carcass across South Africa. Wallahi. And this. Fuck is this cracker to tell me who the fuck I am, who the fuck Kamaru is, who the fuck Nganu is. The fact that as a fucking cracker to tell me who the fuck I am. Ariel tried to get Drikus to dig himself into a deeper hole. At least the one thing that from this whole thing that really pisses me off, to be honest, is that color was born into it. I've never even mentioned color because it makes absolutely no difference to me. You can say a word, a sentence, you can say whatever you want, just the first initial thought. Well, thank you. That's Go. mighty water. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. That's Go. mighty water. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are the words of Drickus and Cameron being taken out of context? Are Izzy, Usman, and the MMA media overreacting? Or are Drickus Duplessis? And Cameron Simon, extremely based. Pictured here is Drikas, chilling in Angola. Here's Cameron talking about the cracker incident. Doesn't look as good on a cracker. <laughs> <laughs> I saw Israel Adesanya call Drikas that. I know. It's it's kind of funny. Okay? Yeah. Because my first thought was like, I kicked a lot of guys in the balls. I've almost lost my privilege yeah. to complain about that are we allowed to complain about the cracker joke no. like are we like, I, i'm not complaining like, i don't care notice his weird analogy of kicking people in the balls we all know cameron loves a low blow but the way he makes it sound here is he can't get upset about the use of cracker because he himself uses racial slurs as much as he kicks people in the balls Insane statement. I don't believe in science. Here, take a look at Cameron Simon's comment section. I'm shocked at how based the young kid is. Cameron Simon is not only based, he is extraordinarily unhinged. He posted this tweet about Kamaru Usman. And then uploaded this footage. My name is Cameron Simon. I'm a professional fighter and I fight dance now for the EFC. How would I describe it? Yeah, it was, it was, let's just say, personally, it was the worst. Four years of my life. <laughs> <laughs> <He's honest. laughs> yeah. oh. Drekus is so based, he doesn't even have words for Islam Makachev. Islam Makachev. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, that, that, does that count? That, that's perfect. That's great. To conclude, there's really not much you can say about how extraordinarily based Drikas Duplessis and Cameron Simon are. They know exactly what they're doing. Keep up the good work, boys. We'll be supporting you. Demon Bobby. Demon Mommy.